let's see a parametric form of straight line which is helpful in solving uh, some geometrical problems consider straight line passing through point uh, x1 comma y1 and having slope 10 theta this line is passing through point uh, P x1 comma y1 and having slope 10 theta means this angle is theta suppose we want to find points on this line at distance r from point P kitne points honge is point se r distance space line ke upar do points honge ek point ye upar ki taraf hoga aur ek point niche ki taraf hoga okay we want to find two points on this line at distance r from P there will be two such point one is here one is here let's find coordinates of this points suppose this point is Q this point is R let's find first of all Q points Q coordinates of Q point now PQ distance is R okay this is perpendicular to x-axis this is also 90 degree then this angle is theta suppose coordinates of this point are x comma y then what is this qr qr is y minus y1 and what will be pr that will be x minus x1 now in triangle P R Q we have cos theta is equal to x minus x1 upon R and sin theta is y minus y1 upon R then x is equal to x1 plus R cos theta and y is equal to y1 plus R sin theta so this are coordinates of point Q and point Q is x1 plus r cos theta comma y1 plus r sin theta if you want to find point R then uh, again draw this right angle triangle this distance is R suppose coordinates of point uh, r r x dash y dash okay suppose this point is s then what is ps length this ps length is y1 minus y dash and what is this rs length that is x1 minus x dash okay now in triangle P S R value of cos theta is x1 minus x dash upon R and value of sin theta is y1 minus y dash upon R from this we get x1 or x dash is equal to x1 minus R cos theta and y dash is equal to y1 minus r sin theta hence coordinates of point r are x1 minus r cos theta and y1 minus r sin theta ok now q and r are points at distance r from point p on this line so we write coordinates of points at distance r 
from point P x1 comma y1 on the line having slope tan theta r x1 plus minus r cos theta and y1 plus minus r sin theta also from points uh, q and r we have x minus x1 upon cos theta is equal to y minus y1 upon sin theta is equal to plus minus r this form of straight line is called parametric form of straight line here r is called parameter if we change the values of r we will get different points on this line at different distances from point p this form of straight line is helpful in solving many geometrical problems in which we can find required point using this form of straight line let's try some question based on this form of straight line try this question a straight line is drawn through this point p2 comma 3 and is inclined at an angle 30 degree with x axis find the coordinates of two points on it at distance 4 from p on either side of p now we know the formula for such points that is x1 plus minus r cos theta and y1 plus minus r sin theta where what is x1 y1 that is given point here given point is 2 comma 3 what is r that is distance okay here it is 4 here 4 is distance of required points from P and how you get cos theta and sin theta that is from slope slope of line that is tan theta okay what is tan theta that is tan of 30 degree this implies cos theta is cos 30 degree which is root 3 by 2 and sin theta is sin 30 degree which is half then this coordinates are 2 plus minus r r is 4 4 cos theta cos theta is root 3 by 2 and y1 is 3 plus minus 4 times sin theta is half then coordinates of the required points are 2 plus minus 2 root 3 3 plus minus 2 so we have two points at distance 4 from point P try this question the line joining two points point uh, a 2 comma 0 and B is 3 comma 1 is rotated about point A in anti-clockwise direction through an angle 15 degree let's draw the diagram there is point A 2 comma 0 and point B that is 3 comma 1 now this line is rotated about point A in anti-clockwise direction what is the angle of rotation that is 15 degree so we have this new line after rotation okay now find the equation of line in new position if B goes to C if you rotate this then now B 
has a new position that is C then we have to find coordinates of point C okay now how you get equation of line AC line line ke liye mein kya kya chahiye ek to point jo hume hai hume given hai A point is given 2 comma 0 aur hume kya chahiye line AC ke liye slope slope ke liye hume kya chahiye angle of line with positive x axis kaise nika sakte hai angle this angle is 15 degree we can also get this angle from slope of line AB now what is slope of line AB that is 1 minus 0 upon 3 minus 2 which is 1 hence this angle is 45 degree okay then slope of AC is equal to 10 60 degree which is root 3 hence equation of line AC is y minus 0 is equal to root 3 times x minus 2 ok now we have to find coordinates of point C now we can find this coordinates with the help of parametric form of straight line kaise nika sakte hai parametric form of straight line ke liye kya chahiye point uh, a jiske coordinates hai 2 comma 0 what is distance AC AC is equal to distance AB and what is AB distance that is square root of 2 so this distance is 2 which is value of R this A point is x1 comma y1 ok and uh, what is tan theta tan theta uh, that is slope of line AC is six, uh, 1060 degree means theta is 60 degree so C ke coordinates kaise aayenge point C has coordinates x1 plus r cos theta y1 plus r sin theta where x1 is 2 plus r is root 2 what is cos theta that is cos of 60 degree comma 0 plus root 2 times sin 60 degree hence coordinates of point C are 2 plus cos 60 is half then this is 2 plus 1 upon root 2 comma root 2 multiply by root 3 by 2 or this value is root 3 by root 2 ok ye jo c point hai wo yaha pe plus sign le ke aara hai to jo agar hum yaha pe sign minus le te to wo point kaha pe aata niche ki taraf aata hai yaha pe thik hai to points ki jo positioning hai usse mein pata chalta hai ki c point ke liye hume yaha pe kaun sa sign use karna chahiye plus sign 